Use a common sense axis origin. Make sure the axis origin is appropriate for the product. By default, SketchUp uses the lower left corner of the selection bounding box. I'm showing it here by this axis icon in these examples, showing the red and green and blue directions. The origin is the point by which everybody will bring it in from the 3D warehouse or from the component browser and place it in the model. This is also the place from which the component will shrink or grow when replaced or reloaded. So this point is very important. Ask yourself, will the placement of my content feel intuitive to the user? So here are some samples of good points. The lower left of the bounding box, if that works for you. The center of an array of objects would be a good point, or the center of an object, like a lamp, a plant, or a swivel chair. I'll place this at the exact center of this space. The midpoint of the back of an object, say a toilet, would be a good example. And I'll place this exactly one foot six from the corner. Or the back left corner, that works well for things that grow out from the wall, like a cabinet. You can also set a component to have gluing behavior where it aligns to any surface that you touch. The inference engine allows you to align things precisely. Here are some examples that work well for objects placed on surfaces. They're modeled in place. If there's a blue X when you select the object to make a component, that means that it is a gluing component. It will stick to the surface based on the axis point. Here are some examples of what not to do. In general, you should not have your origin point off the object. Or for concentric things, maybe the lower left corner isn't very good. Or not some random point in the middle of the object. It's best to use endpoints or midpoints, or known points. When you place the origin point for the component during Make Component, the red and green directions determine the default views of front, back, left, right, and top. If the object is rotated, the front, left, back, and right are going to be oriented to the object's red, green, and blue axis. To correct this, you would right-click inside and select Change Axis and set the new red direction and green direction. And now the front, back, left, and right will be correct for this object. 